All right, this is your last chance to get away from this video. I've gotten a lot of questions about this from forums, stuff like this, people asking on the video, sad update on turtles, how do you preserve your turtle if it dies? They said, I've been getting questions like, do you bury it? I said, I leave it out there. So this is going to be a video of exactly how to get your shell. If you're sque squeamish, you don't want to do this to your turtle. Just don't watch them. But if you really want to do this, then here we go. This is the turtle. Uh, you have to look up the date on the video. I don't even know. It's been months. Turtle has been sitting out here for ever, just sitting in the garden. And as you can tell, there's some stuff left inside. Actually, head isn't even connected. Completely eaten out. This is going to be hard doing this one-handed. But basically, you're just going to pull everything just uh, I'm just going to have to do this like that's leg mm, I don't know what kind of parts dried skin oh. who knows you can see that is part of the spine it's <laughs> collarbone probably All right, boom, completely emptied. I and if I smell it, it has a slight smell. So I don't know what you want to do there. I just take a toothbrush inside there and just scrub it out, and then basically that's it. There you have your shell, and I don't know. This one's actually pretty good, but usually the scoot, the scoots are pretty well dried on this one, but usually they fall off. So. That's, all, that's absolutely all I did. The other ones I clean up really well. Toothbrush, like I said. And they don't smell at all. Do you want to... I don't know if I added soap. No, I just did water. And it doesn't smell at all. And you pretty much have your turtle forever. But I wouldn't recommend throwing these shells around. Because they do, they do break easy. So you want to be careful with these. So, that is it. And then when you have your own shell, you can really go in detail looking at where the veins actually went inside the shell. So, that is it. Please don't post any bad comments. This is my choice. No, I'm gonna get comments saying sick. Don't you should have buried it, but whatever. This was for the people that ask and want to keep something for their turtle yeah. if he died. So sucks because this was a, my female that laid eggs. So. I don't know if you want to keep the skull, but nah, that's not for me. I just keep the shell. I'll bury the I'll bury the bones then. But there you have it. 
a musk turtle skull. Um, all right. And here are my three shells that I now own. Painted turtle I owned for a week. Had respiratory infection when I was a beginning owner. Did not know what that was. So he died within a week of my care. Now I know what it is. But that was my fault for even buying them from the pet store with it. First musk turtle. He probably was really old. He probably had arthritis because just right where his legs went you can see it's already through the shell right there so he had to have he was old he had arthritis that's for sure and then here's the new one scoots still on so who knows if you want them on or off but just turned it really white this is still on still gives it kind of the coloring but turned lighter and painted turtle who knew the bones like of it were like that? But. So there you have it. That's how you preserve them, and this is. Mm, I don't know how long do I want to say? Four years old. Two years old. Mm, I don't know. You have to look at the video how long this shell is, but. There you have it.